snake. That's because Facebook requires me to put a bloody umlaut into my name before it'll recognise it. <laughs> Our internet hasn't been working for the past two weeks because somebody got us put on a list. Velcro. So, as punishment, Velcro's having to power the internet through a single badly framed bicycle. <laughs> So I just thought I'd reminisce on how wonderful the internet is. Like many modern people, I like to spend hours a day forcing my jaded and ill-considered opinions onto total strangers using social media. <laughs> In the past, I had to write individual hurtful letters and throw them at people from the back of a car. It says get a job! Or write to them by post. What an inconvenience. Now, with the power of the internet, I can insult strangers all around the world with just a couple of taps and a couple of clicks. <laughs> Get a haircut, you commie hippie, and send. <laughs> I can even watch badly edited documentaries about how the planet isn't even a globe at all, but a flat disk orbited by a hollow moon populated by reptilian Nazis. <laughs> If you didn't know, the internet was first created by the Chinese in 1912 as a means to allow men to send pictures of their penises to women they didn't know. Hmm. One of the most useful advances of the internet was the invention of the YouTubes by the Reverend Cyril Bullsack. YouTube now makes it even easier to watch unskippable adverts, as in the past people had to send off for them by post and wait for up to a week for an unskippable Grammarly advert to be forced upon them. Oh. Are you illiterate and think that synonym is a type of bun? Join Grammarly today! But how does it work? Well, I'm lucky enough to have one of the YouTubes with me right here. Now, we just need to find some content to upload. So, I've got this little picture of me that I want to send on to the internet. Hmm. And it should be uploading right now. Oh, there it is. Let's try it with something else, such as this delightful picture of well-known Brexit dodger Theresa May. <laughs> oh, and that's uploaded one. Oh, that doesn't seem to have worked. Let's try something different. I'm not racist, but... Technology, eh? Never works when you want it to. In fact, most of the problems with the internet are simply caused by Velcro not peddling fast enough. Faster Velcro! I've got single mothers to upset! <laughs> anyway, thank you for listening to me talk all about the internet. Remember to share these facts with random people on the street or mention them at important job interviews. Join me next week where I'll be filleting a bear. <laughs> Wait, what?